LG G5 has finally been announced. I'm Nick Gray from HD Blog, and this is our quick hands-on with LG's new flagship phone. The LG G5 sports a metal unibody design which wraps around the back and the sides and seamlessly melts into the curved 3D arc Gorilla Glass 4 panel on the front. As far as specs go, the LG G5 comes with a 5.3 inch Quad HD LCD panel. Qualcomm Snapdragon 820 processor, 4 gigs of RAM, 32 gigs of internal storage, and a micro SD card support for up to 200 gigabytes, as well as a 2,800 milliamp hour battery with quick charge 3.0 support. The dual camera setup on the back is comprised of a 16 megapixel and 8 megapixel sensor with a dual LED flash, optical image stabilization, and laser autofocus. The 16 megapixel sensor is there to capture your day to day photos, while the lower resolution camera has an ultra wide 135 degree lens, which captures images which are wider than most humans' field of view. The power button on the back has gotten an upgrade as well, incorporating a fingerprint sensor so that you can securely unlock your device. As rumored, the LG G5 does have an always-on display, which shows the time and notifications, without having to turn things on. LG claims that it only consumes 0.8% of the battery per hour, since only one-third of the display is actually on. The software on the LG G5 is a lot cleaner than what it used to be. That being said, there is no more app drawer, so you will need to hide away your applications in the folders if you want to keep things nice and tidy. The most exciting aspect of the phone is its modular construction. Press a button on the side of the phone and the bottom panel pops off, allowing you to attach various components which enhance the phone's camera and audio capabilities. Overall, the LG G5 appears to be a promising device. The phone feels really nice in the hand and the performance has definitely improved over last year's G4. No specifics on the launch date or price were given, but we can expect the phone to be on the market within the next four to six weeks.